Hi, I'm back with um, a similar layout as what I did for Alex for her twin and the young wild and three and they're actually seven now but you know I'm kind of behind <laughs> and I'm gonna use the same Remini's paper and it's the one that has the green truck on the back um, it's just awesome paper all the way around and and it's called Barnwood Beauty and it's number four okay uh, since I used a red plaid on hers um, one of his favorite colors is green so I've cut it to be um, 11 and 3 16 by 5 and 3 8 because his I've got three pictures of him from that day in the in the petting zoo <laughs> so I'm going to tape these down oh actually I should go ahead and tape this down first oh and I got this on clearance I wonder where I got it I oh it looks like a Hobby Lobby clearance tag 25 cents that's a really pretty piece of plaid okay and I'm just gonna center it and kind of line it up with the wood there and Call that good. Okay. And then I am going to tape all these. Ah, I'm at the end of my tape. Okay, I'm back. And if you ever want to see me reload this anytime, just let me know. And I'll show you me putting it on backwards and then putting it back on the right way. Because I do it every single time. <laughs> okay, and I kind of have this lined up where I think it's like three from the end, maybe three from the top. I try to do an odd number when possible. And I might squeeze it in a little bit more um, at the end. We'll see. Or after I get them laid on here. We'll see how close I am. And they actually kind of fit inside the squares real good. I like that. Oops, didn't have this close enough to being stuck. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna line that up and see if it kind of looks even. I'm always amazed when I see somebody, it's like, ah, oh, they just slap them down and, they, and they're right in the right spot. It's like, how do you do it? <laughs> okay, that looks good. Okay. And then um, I had this other paper. It was just, I don't know where it was from. It was just in my green. And he likes green, so I'm, I wanted to do just a little bit different for him. Um, some of his embellishments will be different, too, than hers. And I don't want to put it down too much just in case I have to pull it back up. You know me. Okay. I'm going to just kind of tuck this under ever so slightly. The whole time that I was going back to get tape, I just kept thinking, kept singing a Christmas song. It's like, oh my gosh. My husband was doing that after Christmas too, and it's like, but you know, we're into March. It's almost my birthday. Maybe I should be singing birthday songs. I think I only know one though. <laughs> oh, except for the one from the Flintstones. <laughs> I think there's one on the Flintstones. Well, maybe I won't tuck it under. It's uncooperative. Okay, I just want it under there a sliver and I think that's all I've got it underneath there is a sliver. 
Okay. So we're going to figure that's its spot. Okay, and then, oh, I should have planned this a little more. Okay, so I'm just going to cut this. And let's see, I could see there was kind of a little bit of a flaw on this one side, so I'm going to try to take that off. I'm giving him a doily too, except for I'm going to pull it in a little bit from the edge. And like hers, I kind of had come out on the edge or come out on the corner. And his, I am just going to have it up at the top. About like that. Okay. Think about like that. I figured this kind of, um, it looks very country, even though they're right in the middle of Tacoma, Washington. Well, I don't know if it was the middle, someplace in Washington, <laughs> Tacoma, Washington. I'm going to slide it down just a little bit, maybe. Let's see, that's good. I think so. Okay, so I'm going to leave that there. And I'm going to put this down, and um, I'm pretty sure this was, nothing was sticking of these. So I'm going to tape it down, and if it needs to be glued, I'll add a little glue later. I think these are so cute, and I told you they were from a summer line. But I thought they looked appropriate for this. Oh, and I need to slide it over just a little bit, I think. So it's going to be hanging off the edge. That might be a problem when I go to put it in the book. Okay, so that's good. And then uh, for him, I also have the little teepee. And again, I'm putting them real close to the same. Um, you know, when you're working with twins, you got to do everything twice. So I'm just trying to switch it up a little bit. And he's going to have different animals. So I'm going to stick this down in here. And so he's going to get a horse. Because even though she was on a horse also, you couldn't hardly see the horse. I mean, you could see her sheep really well, so I figured um, I'd give her the sheep because I, I wish I'd had two sets of these. That would have been fun. But I've had these forever, and I think that they are the um, jo Jolies. cute little horse down here kind of like between so he's not I mean you could hardly see the horse because he's very blurry I guess um, better the horse than Aiden <laughs> so um, and he was also petting the bunny so I know um, Alexandria will be saying how come he got a bunny but he's getting a bunny too Okay, and um, for his letters, I'm going to use the ones I got the other day from Ellie Studio. They're puffy ones, and it says Young, Wild, and Free. And I'm going to put his feather up here, just like I did on hers. Um, now, I was going to use the one that, um, now I've made both these feathers, but um, Ginger Bush had sent me back. Um, some of them for the the swap or the the hop that we did and um, and I was going to use that one but since his one of his favorite colors is blue I thought I just want to use a blue one for him too I mean he's only three 
And besides, um, you know, for years, blue was a boy's color. I gotta tell you, blue is one of my favorite colors. Okay, oops, and I bet you I should use the other thing, but I think if I leave it sit there, it would glue. Because, I mean, it's basically paper, it's wood. Or, or should I say the paper is basically wood. <laughs> Okay, um, I'm going to pause it and put down the letters and then I'll come back and put enamel dots on and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got his Young Wild and 3 on here. So um, I used blue enamel dots on hers um, to kind of break up that there was all the red and then there's, you know, a lot of blue in here. So um, he's got the green. And, and then he's also got blue running through here just like in hers. And I think I'm going to use red. He's got on a red shirt. It'll just be something a little different. And kind of, you know, draw in the color that he's wearing. And so I'm going to put... three over here, or four over here, because I'm bringing one up on the side and just kind of pull them around here, and then I think I'll put probably four up here too. Otherwise, I have a, an even number, and you know how I like to try to pull in that odd number. It's more pleasing to the eye. And then up here, I'm going to do probably like hers. I did it one big one and a small. And then a medium over here. And one of the small ones. Let's see if that arrow is sticking. Yes, it is. So I think that's it. And I've already got planned what I'm going to do next. So um, I will see you soon. I will have stills or, and close-ups at the end. And uh, my, my friend, she was watching. She goes, sometimes you got to um, tip it to show the dimension. <laughs> so I'll kind of do that. Sometimes it does, I know, whatever whatever I'd done the other day, she goes, it's, she goes, when she's seen it in person, she goes, oh, it's so dimensional, I had no idea. So, um, now, this little horse, he is a little bit dimensional, and you know, everything on here kind of is. But, um, so I will be back soon. I do have um, some kind of internet issue where everything's kind of slow loading. So, if you don't see from me, it's just because it's taking me so long to load. But, um, if, it, if it continues, I'm going to call the, um, the internet provider and ask them what the problem is and maybe they can fix it. But, thanks for watching and please like it if you like it and subscribe if you haven't. Bye-bye.